English Pro Get Set Go Level 1 6 and 1 In the previous lesson we learned how to make sentences plus some vocabularies like rides neatly runs quickly swims gracefully and so on with bangla meanings right mahasabin right sposto bhabe taratari shobhamoy bhabe so so in today's lesson we will see the meanings of those vocabularies in english so let's move on the page number is page 26 all right and i forgot to introduce herself miss uh Mahsabin, would you please introduce yourself shortly all right so hello everyone well assalamu alaikum this is me Mahsabin from the Kids center and i am an fifth grader from maple leaf international school all right and this is me azan a voice artist and also a content creator a video artist and esl trainer at tesol bangladesh so Mahsabin, yes um, we are going to look at page 26 and we can see a lots of vocabularies right right Rides neatly, mm -hmm. runs quickly, swims gracefully, cooks skillfully. By the way, do you know how to cook? Well, not really. You should. Um, I guess you know. Do you know how to cook pasta? Well, I can. I only know how to boil eggs. All right, that everyone knows. All right, so. Lesson ta shuru korar age ekta jinish bole nite chai to er por verb er sathe is othoba es jukto hobe na as an example what do you mean by runs quickly it means to run fast so you saw to er por je verb royeche run ekhane ki es othoba es royeche na all right keno because there is a two before the verb. That's right. So, great job. Now, let's learn the meanings of these vocabularies in English. Write neatly. What do you mean by write neatly, Mahsabin? It means to write clearly. Yeah. What do you mean by write? But I guess you can't write clearly. I can. You can? Yes, I can. All right. I actually can't. Okay. Number two. What do you mean by runs quickly? It means to run fast. But she can't. I can't? Yeah. Can you? Yeah, I can. All right. Um, that is the proof that she can't. Um, swims gracefully. What do you mean by swims gracefully? Swims gracefully means swims with beauty. Right. Um, cooks skillfully. What do you mean by cooks skillfully? It means cooks with skill. Yeah. Sings beautifully. What do you mean by sings beautifully? It means sings with beauty. Do you know how to sing with beauty? Not really, but you can. Um, yeah, sir can sing really nicely. She's actually kidding, right? No, I'm not. You can. All right. You Let's sang many times. Not really. Uh, let's move on. Uh, paints vividly means what? Means paints with liveliness. Hmm. 
Uh, what do you mean by speak fluently? It means speaks smoothly. Great. What do you mean by dances elegantly? It means to dance with grace. Um, so I guess you know it, right? How to dance with grace. Uh, hmm. She yeah. knows it. Yeah, so you're kidding. You're kidding, right? Um, no, I'm not. All right. Okay. Then act confidently. What do you mean by acts confidently? It means acts with self-assurance. Great. What do you mean by studies diligently? It means to study hard. She actually studies hard, right? Yeah, I do. Um, what about you? Do you? Yes. Alright. What do you mean by paints passionately? It means to paint with strong emotion. Mm. What do you mean by play soccer Pas passionately? It means to play soccer with strong emotion. What do you mean by smiles cheerfully? It means smiles happily. And you can do that, right? Yeah, I You can. are doing it. Uh, yeah. Um, I wish I could record that. Why? All right, because that's beautiful. All right, thank you. Um, what do you mean by reads avidly? It means reads eagerly. What do you mean by paints creatively? It means to paint with creativity. And American in American accent we say creativity. Yeah, right. Right. Um, by the way, which accent do you love the most? I love British accent the most. British? Yeah, what about you? Same here. Um, I actually don't like American, but I like British. Americans are kind of weird. Like um, water, right? Yeah, it's a bit weird, but most of the people, they follow American accent because they prefer it. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Creativity. Creativity. Mm hmm Paints with creativity in American accent. Then, drive safely. Uh, means drive without danger, right? Right. Uh, what do you mean by speak persuasively? Persuasively. It means speaks convincingly. What do you mean by eats mindfully? It means eats with awareness. All right. What do you mean by listens attentively? It means listens with attention. All right. Uh, do you listen to your teacher in the class attentively or talk with your friends? I listen to my teacher attentively, I guess. You guess? Yeah. All right. Uh, walks, walks briskly. What do you mean by walks briskly? It means to walk quickly. To walk quickly. Uh, what do you mean by things critically? It means things carefully. Um, Masabin. Yes. What do you mean by solves problems efficiently? It means to solve problems with effectiveness. All right. Um, what do you mean by draws precisely? It means to draw with accuracy. What do you mean? What do you mean by listens actively? It means to listen with engagement. What do you mean by works tirelessly? It means to work without rest. All right. What do you mean by hikes energetically? It means hikes with energy. What do you mean by plays music? Passionately. It means to play music with strong emotion. Emotion. 
All right. What do you mean by speaks kindly? It means to speak with kindness. All right. What do you mean by write fluently? It means to write smoothly. Mm. What do you mean by learns eagerly? It means to learn with enthusiasm. Mm. What do you mean by play chess strategically? It means to play chess with a plan. With a plan. All right. Quarrels boldly. What does it mean? It means to argue with courage. Okay. Um what do you mean by things with emotion? It means to sing with feelings. All right. Um what do you mean by acts compassionately? It means to act with empathy. All right. Um what do you mean by swims with confidence? It means to swim with self-reliance. Great job. So you did great. So that was the way how we can learn English, the meanings of any vocabularies in English very easily and very nicely. So Masabin, what do you think? Um if a person who is weak in English if he or she practices like this well if he or she practices like this that person won't be weak in english anymore she is true so we have to practice practice and, and again practice practice that is the only one way um one of the way we can learn english right right uh, without practice nothing is possible mhm mm practice makes a man perfect so thank you so much everyone for hearing us today and this is the way we can enrich our vocabulary level right right so we are done for today's lesson and we will be back with another awesome lesson so stay tuned till then tara tara everyone